affects our emotional, our psychological, and social well-being. This affects areas of our life, which includes our work, school, and home life, our appetite, our relationship with others, our sleep, physical health, and more. This is just as important as our physical health. We have to make ourselves our own priority because it's not a matter of being selfish. It's a matter of self-care, which means resolving our own energy, which promotes healthy and emotional well-being. Mental health is very important because it reflects on our physical, emotional, and our social well-being. As a victim of bullying and a person who experienced depression, the only thing that I can say is that in order for us to take good care of our mental health, we should know how to love ourselves more. Because if we love ourselves, we will be able to love our life and we will be giving more value on our mental health. Mental health. We know that mental health is very important for the well-being of an individual. If you're not in a healthy state of mind, most likely you are at higher risk to have a physical problem. As a matter of fact, study shows that when people struggle with significant mental health problems, they are at a higher risk of having a physical problem. Stay away from destructive behavior. It is important to take care of your mental health by staying away from what we call maladaptive coping skills to deal with anxiety provoking situations. Sometimes people engage in destructive activity to deal with stress, for example, drinking use uh, of alcohol and using street drugs, and many more. Mental health includes our emotional, psychological, and social well-being. It affects how we think, feel, and act. It also helps determine how we handle stress, relate to others, and make choices. Talking about your feelings can make you stay in good mental health and deal with times when you feel troubled. None of us are superhuman. We all sometimes get tired or overwhelmed by how we feel or things don't go to plan. If things are getting too much for you and you feel you can't cope, ask for help. Your family or friends can be able to offer practical help or listening ears. Mental health is the critical necessity for a human person to function in the society. This in turn controls the state of someone being human. It affects us entirely in our everyday life, which is vital for living in this world. Mental health affects our physical health. Many illness matters just as much as any disease, and it can take one's life as easily as any other. Depression, for example, can lead to suicidal ideation and, if untreated, suicidal attempt. The mind and the body are connected. Many mental illness can cause stress, which lowers the immune system. This means more frequent sickness and inability to cope. Stress and anxiety can take toll on our physical health. Worry causes the body to release stress hormones to speed up your heart rate and breathing, raise your blood sugar, and even send more blood to your arms and legs. Over time, this can affect your heart, blood vessels, muscles, and other systems. One stress affects one's physical well-being and ability to take care of themselves, and this may cause destructive patterns. When we reach to this point, we sometimes only then learn that mental health is important. We must not ignore it or other areas of our lives may suffer. Always remember that self-love is the key in order for us to have our power back.